In this module, we will focus on discussing natural supplements to support erectile functioning. We will discuss the following topics, nitric oxide or NO boosting supplements, phosphodiesterase type 5 or PDE5 inhibitor supplements, and other supplements. Nitric oxide, or NO, is a naturally occurring molecule produced in the body. It plays a crucial role in the process of achieving and maintaining an erection. NO functions by relaxing the blood vessels, allowing increased blood flow into the penis, which is necessary for an erection to occur. When the production of NO is reduced, it can lead to decreased blood flow into the penis, resulting in ED. Now, various factors can contribute to the reduction of NO, including damage to the inner lining of the blood vessels caused by a sedentary lifestyle, poor diet, smoking, and other unhealthy habits. Additionally, the production of NO naturally decreases with age, which can contribute to age-related ED. There is an interesting connection between special bacteria found in the back of the tongue, saliva, and the production of nitric oxide. When chewing food, these bacteria in the tongue mix with nitrate in the saliva, which is then converted to nitrite. Upon swallowing, the nitrite is further converted to nitric oxide. Now, this entire process contributes to the production of NO. And as we previously discussed, NO is important for maintaining healthy blood flow and erections. However, the use of mouthwash can have unintended consequences. Now, mouthwash have the potential to kill the special bacteria in the back of the tongue responsible for converting nitrate to nitrite, ultimately decreasing the production of NO. The reduction of NO caused by mouthwash use can have implications for the increase of experiencing ED. Considering this potential connection, individuals concerned about ED may want to evaluate their use of mouthwash and consult with healthcare providers for proper oral care. Increasing nitric oxide levels in the body can be beneficial for promoting healthy blood flow and supporting erections. There are various dietary sources that can help boost NO production. Consuming nitrate-rich vegetables is a great way to increase NO levels. Now, vegetables such as beets, kale, spinach, cabbage, lettuce, broccoli, cauliflower, and carrots are all known to be rich in nitrates, which can be converted into NO in the body. Now, watermelon is another food that can enhance NO production. It contains an amino acid called citrulline, which gets converted into arginine, a precursor to NO. Nuts and seeds, such as almonds, walnuts, flax seeds, and chia seeds, are also beneficial for NO production. They are also rich in arginine, which supports the synthesis of NO. Dark chocolate, particularly varieties with high cocoa content, can also contribute to NO production. It contains flavonols that help stimulate NO synthesis and promote blood vessel dilation. Exercise is a powerful method to increase nitric oxide production in the body as it promotes improved blood flow in the blood vessels. By engaging in regular physical activity, you can enhance NO production and support overall cardiovascular health. Both aerobic and anaerobic exercises have their benefits. Aerobic exercises like walking, running, cycling, and swimming are excellent in promoting blood flow and NO synthesis. Now, these activities increase heart rate and improve circulation, leading to improved NO production in the blood vessels. Anaerobic exercises such as weight resistance training and strength training 
also play a role in increasing NO levels. They stimulate muscle growth and development, which contributes to enhanced blood flow and NO production. Combining both aerobic and anaerobic training in your exercise routine can provide comprehensive benefit for NO production. It is important to find a balance that suits your fitness level and goals. Consulting with a fitness professional or healthcare provider can help you design an exercise plan tailored to your needs. Now, nitric oxide boosting supplements can be used to increase NO production in the body. Two commonly used supplements for this purpose are L-arginine and L-citrulline. L-arginine is an amino acid that can be converted to NO. However, when taken as a supplement, only small amounts of L-arginine reach the penis, limiting its effectiveness for enhancing NO production specifically in that area. On the other hand, L-citrulline is also known as an amino acid that converts to L-arginine, which then converts to NO. So when L-citrulline is consumed as a supplement, it has been found to be more effective at increasing NO levels compared to L-arginine alone. L-citrulline supplementation leads to greater production of NO, potentially benefiting blood flow and erectile function. To maximize the potential benefits, it is often recommended to take both L-arginine and L-citrulline together. By combining these supplements, you can support the conversion of L-citrulline to L-arginine, resulting in higher NO production. Beetroot extract is another natural supplement that can help boost nitric oxide production in the body. Beetroots are naturally rich in nitrates, which can be converted to nitrite when consumed and mixed with saliva. Now, once in the stomach, the nitrite is further converted into nitric oxide, which we already mentioned can improve erections. All in all, when taking supplements, whether it's L-arginine, L-citrulline, beetroot, extracts, or any other supplements, it is important to consult with a healthcare professional before starting any new supplements, as individual needs and potential interactions with other medications or health conditions should be considered. I want to talk about nitric oxide test strips. Now, nitric oxide test strips are a simple and convenient way to measure the levels of NO in the body. These test strips are designed to measure the amount of NO in the saliva. By using these test strips, individuals can get an indication of the amount of NO that is being circulated through their body. Now, low results on the test strips may suggest that there are low levels of NO present in the body. Monitoring NO levels using these test strips can provide valuable information about NO production and circulation. It can help individuals assess their NO status and potentially identify any deficiencies that may be affecting various physiological processes, including blood flow and vascular health. Here is a photo of a bottle of nitric oxide test strips that can be purchased at a pharmacy or reputable store online. You can see how the results in the two strips in this photo can be compared to the color scale on the bottle, indicating the level of NO in the saliva and circulating in the body. Of the two strips, the one on top resulted in a very light color indicating a very low, almost depleted NO count. The strip on the bottom resulted in a darker pink and red color, indicating a rather high NO count. I would like to present a case study of a 50-year-old male with complaints of mild to moderate erectile dysfunction that had persisted for several months. An initial assessment of using a nitric oxide test strip revealed a depleted level of NO in his body, 
indicating a potential underlying issue with NO production and circulation. Based on this finding, the individual started taking a combination of L-arginine and L-citrulline. After a few weeks of consistently taking the L-arginine and L-citrulline combo, this person began to notice improvements in his erectile function. His erections became more consistent and firm, indicating a positive response to the regimen. Over the course of a couple months, he continued with the L-arginine and L-citrulline combo, and his erectile function further improved. He reported experiencing consistent and satisfactory erections, indicating successful management of his ED symptoms. This photo shows the results of his nitric oxide test strips that he tested over the course of three months. They were each tested about one month apart from each other. When comparing to the color chart on the bottle, you can see in the first strip on the left, the results showed a depleted amount of nitric oxide. As mentioned, he started taking daily nitric oxide supplements of L-arginine and L-citrulline. About a month later, the second test was taken, which is the middle strip. And you can see that the color is darker and showed improvements. The client continued to take daily NO supplements and a third test was taken about a month later. The result is an even darker color, almost an optimal level. Next, I want to talk about phosphodiesterase type 5 or PDE5. Now PDE5 is an enzyme found in the walls of blood vessels, including those in the penis. Its primary role is to regulate the contraction and relaxation of smooth muscles in the blood vessel walls. As we discussed before, when one becomes sexually aroused, the release of nitric oxide causes the smooth muscles in the penis to relax allowing increased blood flow and resulting in an erection. However, once sexual stimulation diminishes, PDE5 comes into action. The PDE5 is one of the key enzymes that eventually helps to constrict the arteries in the penis, allowing blood to flow back out and causing the erection to subside and become flaccid. PDE5 inhibitors are a class of medications that work by blocking the action of PDE5. So by blocking PDE5, blood continues to accumulate in the penis and erections remain. Common PDE5 inhibitors include medications like Viagra and Cialis. There are supplements that are PDE5 inhibitors. Now, PDE5 inhibiting supplements are natural products that contain compounds capable of inhibiting the action of the PDE5 enzyme, similar to prescription medications like Viagra and Cialis. One such supplement is horny goatweed. Horny goatweed, also known as epimedium, is a traditional Chinese herb that has been used for centuries to enhance sexual function. It earns its name when a goat herder observed increased sexual activity in his goats after they consumed a particular plant. The active ingredient in horny goatweed is acarian, which has been found to have PDE5 inhibiting properties. Icarian is a natural PDE5 inhibitor that promotes smooth muscle relaxation and maintains blood flow in the penis. So it mimics medications like Viagra and Cialis. However, it's important to note that PDE5 inhibiting effects of horny goatweed may not be as potent as prescription medications. The effectiveness can vary among individuals, and the results may be milder compared to pharmaceutical options. Thus, horny goatweed is a natural supplement from a plant, while the medications like Viagra are synthetically made. We will discuss more about the medications like Viagra in a future module. 
There are other supplements often mentioned that may have NO boosting and PDE5 inhibiting actions. Now they may or may not be as effective as the supplements previously discussed in this module. So the list of other supplements include Thai ginseng or black ginseng, Korean ginseng or Panax red ginseng, Ginkgo biloba, Tribulus terrestris, Yohimbe, Ashwagandha, and Maka. Now I encourage you to do your own research on these supplements and search by using reliable and accurate resources. The Food and Drug Administration, FDA, in the United States does not regulate dietary supplements in the same way they regulate pharmaceutical drugs. The FDA does not have the authority to pre-approve or evaluate the safety and effectiveness of dietary supplements before they are marketed to the public. It is important to understand that the effects of supplements can vary from person to person. What may work well for one individual may not have the same effect on another. Additionally, the quality and purity of supplements on the market can vary, so it's important to choose reputable brands and products. Consulting a healthcare provider before taking any supplements is a wise decision. They can assess your individual health status, review potential interactions with medications you may be taking, and provide guidance on the appropriateness and potential risks associated with specific supplements. A healthcare provider can also help you monitor your progress and make adjustments as needed. In summary, nitric oxide plays a crucial role in achieving and maintaining an erection. When there is insufficient NO in the penis, it can result in erectile dysfunction. NO boosting supplements like L-arginine, L-citrulline, and beetroot extracts can help increase the production of NO in the body, potentially improving erections. In addition, PDE5 inhibitor supplements like horny goatweed work by blocking the action of PDE5, which allows for increased blood flow to the penis leading to improved erections. Finally, consult a healthcare provider when taking supplements. In the next module, we will discuss devices and aids, including sex toys, prostate massage, pelvic exercises, and sensual touch.